this is the Moj Moj claw machine. Um, I think they're around 50 bucks at Walmart. I've actually had this for a couple months. I just kind of forgot I had it. I got stuck in a corner. And anyway, I need to take it out of the packaging and I'm going to test it out. It says it's a real working claw machine. So we'll see. And it comes with six of these eggs, which I guess you put in there to grab. So um, let me take off the packaging, set up my tripod, and we will test this out. All right, here it is out of the package. Um, so it has a checklist. I put those eggs in the back. There is a hole right here to put the eggs in. And it's got little tokens to get the machine going. And then it has instructions. Those aren't really that hard to get out of the box. But the problem is, guess what? It takes 3D batteries. I don't have D batteries, I just have C. So I'm just gonna have, and I'm not running out to the store right now in the snow. So I'll have to come back to this. Um, did it say it on the back in the box? Okay. This is my main complaint. <laughs> I'm looking at the box. 24 coins. I'm looking at the box. And no, okay, yeah, it does. All right, it does say batteries required in this extremely small print on the bottom of the box that you don't look at when you buy. Just a suggestion to Moj Moj, in case they're watching this video, you might have wanted to put a sign that said needed batteries in a better location. Not everyone has D batteries sitting around. I would have bought them at the store, but who's going to look at the bottom for this small print at the store? I'm a little disappointed. I can't play it. Not yet. I have to go to the store and get batteries. But that's my only complaint so far. You got every a parent knows what I'm talking about. You've bought toys and it clearly says needs batteries on the front so you know to get batteries. It fooled me. It fooled me. So anyway, I will run to the store this afternoon and do a take two. Alright, I finally got the three D batteries required for my Moj Moj claw machine and this is going to kind of be hard to record because it's kind of like a really big claw machine and so my cell, my cell phone is getting way too close. So, it came with six eggs and um, these little plastic tokens. There's no on and off, I mean there is an on and off button, but like putting the token in is what starts it. So put the token in and you got your circus theme music and, okay wait, I gotta pick this up. It's a little, okay no wait. Oh, a little confusing. I don't know how this works. Alright, let's go to the right. I'm gonna go for this green ball. Like, in a typical claw machine, once you get to where you want... Okay, that's up or down. Oh, you press a button. There is no button, so you have to press the lower button. So let's lower it. And now, bring it back up. Oh, I grabbed it. And now hit the lever to the left. Ta-da! I got it on the first try. Okay, and then forward. And then I don't know what drops it. Do we need to go down? Yep. Oh. Well, I got it. And it is sealed in plastic. So... There's no way I'm opening that with one hand. No way. I'm assuming it's just more of the Moj Moj. They're little plastic squishy ones. I have a video reviewing them. Um, so they're soft squishies. Let's see. Let's get another one. I'll open the eggs. I'll just have to put the camera down. All right, so we want this to go back up to close the claw. Now, let's see, what do I want to do? You know what? I want to go... I want to get this yellow one right here on the front. I like it. I like the... I like the carnival circus music. Oh no, it twisted. Is it going to grab it? I don't know. It twisted. Oh, well, it did grab it. Yay! Two for two. Alright. And now, press down. Right? Oh, it's this one. Press down. 
that's weird. So that one shows I won, and then the other one made the weird loss sound. All right. Second egg. Now, uh, I don't know why it's doing the losing music. Okay, let's try it again. Do, 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 do. That music's very catchy. All right, so we want this to go. Nope, up, 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 up. Let's just go to the pink one. Yeah, it was right in the middle. And see, this is like, we definitely could put other toys in it once I run out of these. Or just keep plastic eggs and add all kinds of plastic eggs. So we need to go down. Did I go? Uh oh, am I gonna get it? And then go back up. I like it. And then go to the left. Go forward. And then go down. And there we go. Third egg. <clears throat> And see there's like a hole in the back so you can put the eggs back in there pretty easily and then there's a slot in the bottom to take out the coins when you run out of coins. But they actually give you a lot of little plastic coins. They're just little, do they? Let's see. Dollar symbol on one side and 10 on the other. I mean it would have been cool if they would have had like a emoji emblem on it. So these are just like generic plastic, plastic coins nothing that marks them as a brand that's fine so this one's 20 cents okay so i am going to peel the plastic off of these three and we'll see what's inside all right i peeled the plastic off of them so let's see if i can just open it one-handed i don't know if you squeeze it there yep that one opened pretty easily so this is a little um I don't know a pink cutie something like a polar bear maybe I don't know so I, I these emojis they're different they um, the only thing I don't like about them is they can get dirty pretty easily the stuff sticks to these like crazy let's see but they are adorable <clears throat> they're not slow rise they're simply they're just squishy you know what I mean like if you're a kid from the 80s it's like the stuff you threw at the wall and it stuck like, remember those octopuses that you throw at the wall and they would stick? It kind of reminds me of that. So, it's squishy, but not. Oh, this is like a jellyfish. Oh my god, that's adorable. It's just got like a jelly consistency. You know what I'm saying? So, they are cute. Just not my favorite type. I like slow ride squishies. Alright, and so then this is... This is a white... Oops, there goes that. This is a white elephant, right? Doesn't that look like a... Ooh, that one's adorable. Yep, that's a white elephant. So I like that these are Easter egg shaped. So definitely when Easter comes around, I'm going to buy more plastic eggs or... I don't know, do I have... I don't even think I have an Easter decoration box. If I... Why don't I have Easter eggs? If I had Easter eggs, I would fill this completely full of Easter eggs and just put various like treats and stuff in them. So it is very, very cute. And let's just do it one more time because the sound, oh my God, I love the sound. Wait, why did that not work? Did I break it already? There we go, there we go. All right, let's go. Is it possible? to get this yellow all the way over in the right hand corner. So yeah, these eggs are just like the standard Easter egg size, so I'm definitely, I don't think I'm gonna get it. It didn't swing. Oh my God, I'm gonna lose. I lost. Wait, we want that to go up. Oh. Oh, how did it? <clears throat> oh, there we go. Oh. All right. So will it let me try it again? Yes, it will let me try it again. All right. That's a bad spot. Classic claw machine, the unattainable right hand corner. Okay. Let's go. Oh. Why is it not going up? Oh, you have to. Okay. It's gotta go through the process. All right. What? Okay, it's done. I ran out of time. It timed out on me. Um, like I said, there's no on and off 
button there's a for the battery pack there is but the actual game aspect of it it's the coin that activates it let's do another one all right let's, let's go for the beat i do like it and the shoot is in the way oh oh my goodness that ain't good come on all right Locked again. All right. Let's... Well, those two corners. That's not going to be possible. Let's see. I got to go this way. Nope. So now the three left are unattainable. Unless, you know, I could just move them around by tilting it. But you get the idea. So, yep. I just have it sitting up here in my office next to my other claw machine. Um, I got this one at Dave & Buster's. I have a video on it. It still works great. You just have to put quarters in it. So, I'm not going to do it right now, but it works great. So, got my two little claw machines here. Now, goal, life goal, I need a huge claw machine. I have to talk my husband into buying me that. But yeah, overall, this is a cute claw machine. Um, I think it was worth it. I think, how much did I spend? 50 bucks? I really do think it was worth 50 bucks because it's pretty heavy duty plastic. I feel like it's going to last a while. And I like that adding eggs is pretty easy. And I like that it's just typical Easter eggs. So, you know, you pretty much get those pretty easily. And then fill them. Or you can, I think you can buy these. I don't know. Because when you buy emojis, they come in like triangular blind packs, not the eggs. So I think you would just, um, if you wanted to refill it with emojis, you'd have to buy Easter eggs and then put emojis in it. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to put other toys in it. So anyway, thanks for watching. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons, and I will see you later.